Um, um, snack, 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 snack. We continue. I forget where I'm going. Let's check to see if that lady's done with the thing. Run, take a look. Not a uh, blah blah. This is a state a statement piece, an unapologetic artistic display. This is what one would wear to dazzle with the power of a titan and the majesty of a queen. Received a magnificent cape. It shines and shimmers with glorious splendor. Rad. Yes, yes, it is rad. Bend a buzz Abizado, my regards. Oh my god! really don't remember where I'm supposed to go. Oh, hardball snacking. Ain't got anything else to steal? No. Dang. Can I open this? Nothing. Maybe 
Rio the Palace? <laughs> I don't fucking remember. <laughs> yeah. Uh, my ball. I don't look familiar. Not here. You, you're the, the booty hunters. Drunk again. So, did, did you do it? Yep. Maze and, Ros and Rosaline. Kill them both. Nice. Shame I don't have a seed to pay you. <laughs> the sterling knight. Any of us. Figured as much from the start. Enjoy your grog. Cranbale. I even go anywhere in Cranvale. Hope you had a pleasant flight. Oh, hello. <laughs> oh, uh, all right. I'm I'm not looking for trouble. I'm I am still streaming. I'm playing a uh, small saga. Neither are we. Oh, great. Wait. <laughs> Wait, Mole Wizard, you're carrying a fire starter, right? A fire starter? Oh, right, my wand. Yes, can I please see it? All right. <laughs> Oh, that's that's cool. You've done some modding work, right? Losing the spark wheel, maybe widen the wick. Got it. Got a good eye for technology. Uh, thanks. You too. But you know, there's a way to push it further. You ever heard of naphtha? Naphtha fuel, right? <laughs> Not just any fuel. It's the mythical shrew fight. Centuries ago, the Golden Laurel Empire's navy used it to decimate enemy ships. Terrifying and, vo and volatile material, it creates a fire that even the gods fear. Yep, that's the stuff. Super cool, right? A fire that can burn even water itself. I can hardly imagine. Okay, I see where this is going. Huh? It's a sales pitch. How much for one bucket of this magical fuel, Mr. Lizard? Oh, uh, it's frack. It's not magic, it's science. Yes. And, uh, I wasn't looking to make some seeds, but we could talk about a trade instead. A trade for what? Technology for technology. He just does. Give me something rare, something unique, something I've never seen before. Got piles of unique tech in my den, Cranvile. It's just around the corner. I it wouldn't take a minute to go grab something. You remember you're banished, right? Mammy's not going to welcome you home with hugs and kisses. I know, but if Gwen has the courage to return to her home, then so do I. 
you say so. Okay, Frack, we'll fetch some gadget and you'll give us the magical juice. It, it's not magic or juice. Bear me to techie talk. We'll be back soon. What's wrong? Having second thoughts. What if Mammy sees me? If it gives you any lip, I'll dish out twice as much back. <laughs> no, it's, it's not like that. It's... She's family. I know I should make her make up with her. That's what I'm supposed to do, right? But I don't know if I'm ready to have that conversation too well. Come on. I don't know the details of your childhood, but I know this. You don't have you don't owe your mother forgiveness. Don't even owe her a conversation. If you don't want to see your mother, then you don't then don't give her a second of your time. Really? That seems so cruel. Not at all. If she respected you for your if she's if she can't respect you for who you are, then she doesn't deserve you. I don't know if I can see it that way, but I'll do my best. Gwen and Neil keep watch at the side. Bull settlements are a wee bit small for us anyhow. Great, we're all set then. Then to Cranbale? Yes. I can't believe you're yawning. Cranbale. The thingy we want is uh, in your little treasure trove, right? Right, I'll leave the way. Uh, hi, hi, Auntie. Hello, Siobhan. Um, mm -hmm, say no more. It was easy to read a children's picture book. Don't worry, I won't tell your mother that you came through. Thank you, Auntie. You're the best. Mm hmm. Back in my old den. Nostalgic, right? You could say that. I used to come in here and tinker with something whenever Mammy and me would uh, would argue. But by the time you arrived, I knew the ins and outs of all kinds of godly things. Oh, right. Almost forgot. Why? Almost forgot why we came here. This won't take a second. Vaughn found a digested, digitized pet. Oh, my God. You add it to your trinkets. Well then, huh, that's all. Yep, let's go. Lady Shaban. Play hey, Master Nemian. I remember you, the Hedge Knight. You don't need to say anything. We're banished, I know. We're just leaving. Let's go, Shaban. Wait. Shabon, Lady G Gilda misses you, dear. Misses you dearly. She wants to see you. She does. I don't want to see her. Maybe I will someday, but not today. You can tell her that. You've grown a lot since the last time I saw you. But you're still Lady Gilda's daughter. You have obligations, familial duties. You don't get to just throw all that away because it makes you uncomfortable. I said no. You heard them. We're going. This is ridiculous. What kind of girl refuses to see her own mother? Must I really drag you to the throne room by the tail? I'm not a girl, Nemian. No, I'm not a girl, Nemian. No longer. And I'm not a plaything to be dragged. You can reject the labels, but at the end of the day, we are both bound by our roles. You are the lady's daughter, and I am the lady's ward. That is the way of, the, of society. Grow up and accept it. Need a paw? No, this is my fight. I think you think yourself a warrior. I know myself a warrior. Hmm. I'll be the judge of that. Hello, the clock. Not attacking, then I'll just come back to you.
whack. <laughs> yeah. You will, huh? <laughs> Ow. Come on. I can hardly believe how much you've changed. You've really grown up. I'll take my leave, and you two can take yours. Are you going to tell Mammy I was here? I'll tell her you were, I'll tell her you're thriving, nothing more. That's the truth, after all, and I'm glad for it. Lady or warrior, girl or boy, neither. Your or neither. Your father would have been proud of you, Shaban. Level up. Nice fighting, you alright? Never been better. I'll see you outside, Sir Verm. We've got to go meet uh to go meet Frack. Right. Let's go. Um. I mean, we want that. Can we go fight Gat? We can go in here? Hell yeah. This all bring back strange memories. Nost nostalgic, right? Hmm, I don't know if I would say nostalgic. I'm just only something... Titan fur and indignation. Jesus Christ, I had so much trouble there. We're not alone. Yeah, that'll be Tiger. The fella day, he's probably watching us right now. There's a fella day in this room? Relax. He wouldn't dare try anything. Come out. Come out, Tiger. I would like to talk to the mouse. Alone. Not a chance. Take another step, and the four of us will skin you alive. That's fine. Go. Really? Really? You sure? Kitty cat here won't try anything. If you say so. Shout if you need it. <laughs> Shout if you need anything. I went the wrong way. So, what's up? I caught wind of your quest, Mouse. Oh yeah? I didn't know Felidae cared about rodent matters. This is bigger than Rodentia. The mouse attacking a fella day is an, uh, um, and is, is an absurdity, but a mouse seeking to kill a god. What violates the- that violates the law of the old way itself. I didn't know fella day cared about the old way either. Every animal follows the old way. The laws are writ in blood and bone. You think that they can be discarded so easily. Tossed aside because your whims demand it. Absurdity of absurdities. There is but one truth, and it is this. We are all bound by our nature. <coughs> Five slashes? Oh my goodness. But what if we rage and then do it? <laughs> nature sends my way, then I'll just say nature itself. Absurd. <coughs> Storm? What will you do once you have conquered nature? Reign as the god of mouse, king of nothingness, wretched thing you disgust me. <laughs> Overkill. Level up. Server. <coughs> Are you okay? Yeah, of course. What was that all about? What was that all about? Nothing important. Let's just get out of here. Uh, yeah, you're right. I need to go... Cool. <coughs> he can do a lot of damage now. Go talk to Frack. Or Bat. Take a look, Frack. Whoa! Is this, the, this is the coolest thing I've ever seen. There's a little guy in there. Ha! Yes, there is. I'm true to my word. Pass me your wand and I'll fill it up with naphtha. Maple. Hmm. Doesn't seem different to me. Gotta hold the trigger down. Really pump it full of that magic juice. Oh. Oh, shit. Japan learned hellfire. 
Now we can go back in there. Let's go visit uh, Greg, Sir Greg, I think the name. Does that seem to be the correct way to go over there? What's going on to Whitehall? This stop is Whitehall. Climb up the ladder. Anything here? Yes. Firm. This place carries painful memories. Memories of what the gods did to me. Memories of my lost family. So you better have a good reason for taking me back here. I do. Closure. Closure? I already settled things with Sir George. <clears throat> I'm not talking about that guy. Is there someone else who wronged you? Sir Verm, I hope you know what you're doing. I have no idea what I'm fucking doing. <laughs> Quite. Since your last visit, I investigated the other rooms. For whatever reason, the gods have decided the White Hall as an institution is over. Our rapture draws near. The whole colony shall be eradicated. I trust in the gods' judgment, but it's a bitter truth to acknowledge. White gods are going to kill every last resident? Not every resident. One member of White Hall will live on. At least, a rebellious dragon. I take some solace in that. Why don't you and whoever's left just pack up and get out? Ancient sacamores cannot sprout young roots. What is that? Some corny old way proverb? The old way is law. Those who rebel against it are doomed to a wretched fate. Do not linger. The white god is close. There's no convincing George. Let's go, Verm. What does this do? Do not press it. Why not? Because it is forbidden. Well, that just makes me want to press it more. One time I saw a god accidentally brush against it. It made a right racket, screeching noises and flashing lights. We were freaking out like the sky was falling. The gods got all riled up too. But then it stopped and that was that. No consequences, no aftermath. Kind of anticlimactic, to be honest. I see. I see. So... It's a siren the gods reserve for emergencies? We should avoid it, and the noise would draw unwanted attention. Push the button? We push the fucking button. A shiver runs out through you. Your fur stands on end. Are you really sure you want to push it? Firm, stop. Let me do it. <laughs> Wait, here I go. Idiocy! Now look what you've done! Leave now, quick, before the white god comes and smites you all. No, not yet. I see that what Verm was doing by dragging me back here. For all my talk of rebellion, I've avoided confronting the one who wronged me most. You want to confront the white god? Idiocy of idiocies! Don't throw your wife away to spite a deity. This isn't spite. It's justice. Call it what you will. I cannot partake in such blasphemy. <laughs> That's him. Uh, uh, are we really doing this? I think we are. Chris, brace yourselves. <laughs> Fighting a god.
It's a hand. It's a 3D bot. Oh god. Let's test the limits of this god's mortality. <laughs> it's the white god. Eat Hellfire. 59 damage. Um, let's sword break that one. I think I might kill the left hand with this attack. Oh no, I'm not gonna do that much. Okay. Did a lot. And use shield break. Oh fuck. It flicked! <laughs> Let's kill this fucking hand. Storm. Let's really do some fucking damage. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Get fucked, God. <laughs> I think I think I just I think I just killed a god. We we did it. We fought off a god. That was... I have no words. Burn. hey, are, are you okay? I'm, I'm fine. It's just... We barely made a scratch. It'll take more than our tiny weapons to slay a god. Madness! You are all mad. Utterly, utterly mad. I dare say your idiotic actions have only hastened the white god's destruction. White hall's destruction. Yeah, probably. That god looks pissed. Better clear out of here before he comes back. You blaspheming little. George, Verm's right. You said yourself that White Hall is over, but your life isn't. Find anyone who's left alive in the other rooms and go somewhere else. Somewhere else? The Sky Garden, Murda. You can even find a new city. Found a new city, if you wanted. A, a new 
Noirty Duau Guin. No, uh, oh my god. A hall without gods. <laughs> mm, same old twin. Always disrespectful. Always rebelling. A ruined who rejects dogma dies in lonely sinful misery. That's what I always thought. And yet here you are, Sand, proud and joyous. You don't need the old way. You pave your own path. It is difficult for an ancient sycamore like me, but maybe I can find the strength to do the same. Ish, really? Where was this open mindedness back when we were dating? Let me make men's a penance of sorts. I can teach you the late uh, lancing technique passed down from my ancestors. The Knights of Pyrol. Uh, uh, it, it is a powerful strike that cuts through any sword and shield. When learn Sky Vault. Cool. You should leave while the peace remains. Take care, Gwen. And you. I don't think I can make it to that one. One extra damage for each stack of this. Uh, you want to play tomorrow? Now, I could just end stream here. I did a major fight. <laughs> I think I accomplished enough for today's stream. I think, I think, I think, uh, I think I'll end stream right here. Yeah, 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 yeah. And watch me explode the stream. Explosions!